In today's video, I'm gonna talk about my weight loss and also bust another myth, and that's the one about water loss with a keto diet. Hello and welcome to day 50. And as I mentioned, I'm gonna talk about two things today. Number one, I'm gonna talk about my weight loss, and number two, I'm gonna talk quickly about another myth and actually bust that myth and that's the one about, uh, about uh, water loss. Okay, but first of all, weight loss, I lost 0.1 of a kilogram and that's about two tenths of a pound. So that brings my total weight loss since I started now to 10.1 kilograms and that's about 22 and three tenths of a pound. Okay, myth time. The next myth is about water loss and specifically, uh, there's a myth out there that actually says if you're on a keto or slash low carb diet, that the only weight you'll lose is water water and uh, nothing else and basically that's how you're losing weight it's, it's basically from water coming out of your body so it's not true weight loss myth is about to be busted first they've got a link in the in the uh, video description which you can find out more information on but basically what actually happens is, is when you're on a high carb diet your body will naturally retain water it retains water because of the carbs and the sugar and so forth that you're ingesting and when you start a low carb diet or a keto diet you'll find that uh, the body does the, does the opposite. Because you haven't got all these, uh, uh, the amount of carbs going into your body, your body, your kidneys start dumping that excess water. So yes, initially you do lose, uh, your initial weight loss is from water. But over time, as your body adapts to this new keto lifestyle, it actually starts um, naturally needing less. So you're not actually losing water anymore because you've reached a level where the keto has kicked in and you're actually um, basically just surviving on a keto diet. And you're not actually losing more water at that point. So certainly you should be keeping up your water. Uh, and also potassium and magnesium are very important as well, so keep that in mind. But totally a myth that uh, that is the case, it's actually the reverse, that a high carb diet keeps, retains water in your body, and because you're going on a low carb diet, as I said, your body is flushing that out because it no longer needs it. So that's your initial weight loss. But after that initial period of time, once you become keto adapted, you're losing weight in all the right areas. And again, we're not on a protein uh, low diet, low protein diet, so you're getting adequate protein, so the fat we're losing is, is actually literally from our fat stores and not from the um, muscle, which of course you'd get if you weren't having enough protein. So but again, very healthy, and this is another myth that's out there that people seem to think is the case. It's very, very closely related to the myth that I talked about yesterday actually as well. All right, uh, so check out that video if you need to. All right, well that's day 50 out of the way. Things are still progressing well, and I'll be back with another video tomorrow. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click this button here. You can see it on the screen now, that's the like button. Please do that, it helps spread the word and get other people to actually find my videos, which is fantastic, it's a win-win. Also, if you want to comment on my videos, please do so, that's over there, right over there. If you do that, I will actually respond to any questions you might have. And lastly, and probably most importantly, please subscribe. That's right, click that button right there now. You can do that right now while I'm talking, and you can subscribe to my channel, and you'll be updated automatically every time I uh, release a new video, which is often. Thanks again for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll be back with another video soon. Cheers for now.